Hello everyone, and thank you for joining me here. I do appreciate it, guys. Uh, so, last time, as we all know, we, the greatest of all the Germans, have besides unified our different people within our country, but we've also unified into the German Empire, and thusly have begun Germanizing the rest of our nation. Hopefully. Austrianizing. Whatever you may want to call it. So, uh, we're getting attacked pretty heavily in Spain, which isn't good, but we're really, this time, going to focus on, uh, oh, you have an extra guy here. Nice, fault there. But we're going to really focus on finishing up Europe. That's really our goal. Finish up Europe. And we're going to start off by trying to take out the French. Oh, oh, nice convoy song, convoy song. Hopefully we can take out more, take at least more of the Chinese territory this time. Maybe take them out completely. I don't know. We'll see what happens. Uh, I did give the German government an exile some more of its soldiers, or I guess more of its territory back from the French Republic, which didn't make any sense to me at least. I don't know. Maybe I'll change that. They're still here. They're still alive for now, but they're not going to last forever. That's how I'm going to put it. Oh god, these guys are dying like crazy. Uh, Ottoman soldiers. If you have to, we must have Gibraltar. So, at least guard all of this. So, go ahead and maybe fall back. Spain has half a million soldiers. We really can't afford to lose very much here. But I'm going to go ahead and put some extra naval bases down here, just in case we might lose a few. And I don't want to lose the territory. That's what that's that's pretty much it. Uh, Denmark. Fall. Oh, Fifty six divisions. You know what? Sure. No, I'll ask. I'll ask for divisions when I need them. That's that's what my goal. I will ask when I need them. I don't need them currently. So, uh, we do, we will go to war with Azerbaijan. I don't much, let's just go right now, why not? Oh, because their soldiers are still trying to spring over, and it's lagging. Very hard. It feels like someone's being released, perhaps? Before we do anything, uh, did anyone get rid of it? Yeah, that's mine. That's the German government in exile. Oh, the French Republic is still up here. Hmm. Uh, did anything happen? I don't think so. How's Brazil doing, actually? I've kind of ignored them. This rate just, just go like crazy. You too. Oh, you, you guys are. Okay. You guys just go nuts. Go nuts, guys! Oh, Adler, do you have anything? So that's weird. It was lagging very hard, but there was no change, except the United States has Texas and is completely surrounded by enemies. Maybe except for Mexico. Huh. Anyways, Canada is pretty much. pretty much contained, it looks like, a large portion of the German invasion. Uh, yeah, that was weird. Anyways, let's go ahead and go to war with Azerbaijan. Right. There we go. And time to get some coffee while we're waiting. Very good. Alright, so we have XL divisions. Oh, we were over here. Alright. Um, not sure why that was there, but let's go ahead and get out of the territory of these guys. So that way we can come back and strike back at them, because we can't just have a German government in exile. No, 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 no. I don't believe it. Uh, if I... Japan, you're my puppet, right? What are you doing, Japan? You got invaded, but you have all this territory. The Republic of Siam is in the Entente. I remember liberating them. Huh. We're pushing up, hopefully. Doing fairly well. How far is German China? They're not that far to capitulation. 36%. Very good. Oh man, we are losing hard. At this point, uh, we definitely need to fall back. Right. Soldiers, when you can, please fall back. And as we will continue. Actually, I could should have used some of those Coast Guards. It's alright. 
Oh, well, actually, yeah, we, I should have taken all those, those guards. I need, I literally need 15 more divisions. So, uh, Denmark. They have two, over 200? Oh, I'm taking 77 then. I don't need all those boys. I hope these are all Danish. Yes. Awesome. Nice coverage. Let's see. Oh, very nice. In exchange for unfortunate number of allied Persian ships. But, uh, let's build up the airbase here. I really should have done this before. Wait, hold on. Stability, that seems awfully low. Yeah, 50, I always want to stay at 50 because I don't want any, anything like the war support thing where you might not get volunteers or something, such as, oh, people are revolting against you, oh no, or they don't like being conscripted. Oh. Man, I'm not, I'm not having it today, I guess. I know I was very dazed yesterday. Oh my gosh, look how terrible this stuff is. Why is it so laggy? It is Kaiser Rekord Force. But, shoot, this is laggy. I don't think I need this much anti tank. Uh, let's see, SP light artillery. Yeah, I definitely need to make sure we got air superiority in the water. We need, definitely need to make an adjustment on our modern tanks. Look at all these things. I'm not even using these. I don't believe I'm even using jet fighters yet. Or these. Oh my. Do we really have 5,000 tactical bombers? We definitely don't have any jet tactical bombers. Heavy fighters. Go ahead and just get rid of those. Yeah, we got a crap ton of enemy equipment that we just took. Probably from the Germans, honestly. We probably got most of the equipment from the Germans that took a bunch of equipment from other places, so. Unfortunately, you're gonna have to suffer through this with me at the moment, or just skip ahead, like, by, say, a minute. Probably be doing something else. Alright, we're done with that, and... Alright. Plus, am I even using close air support? Uh, I, I really wish, I said this before, but I really wish there was a do not collect enemy equipment button, because that would be nice to have as an option. And, nah, screw it, we'll do that too. Since I'm here, I'm destroying everything that I can find. I might as well at this point. And let's see, yeah. I just really wish there was a button. I'm sure there's a mod. There's got to be a mod. I'm sure I can find it. You can toggle whether you want enemies equipment or not. Uh, good enough for now. All right, so and we didn't even hit a minute yet when I said that thing. I'll see in a minute. Oh my gosh! Still, how many? That's bad. That's not hot. That's not hot. All right. Anyways, ah, da da da. Tactical. Oh my good God. Yeah, I got. I've got to find a mod for this or something. How many planes we got in the water? Uh, that should be good enough for now. I already told him to do that. Good, good, good. Oh, we lost three allied convoys, but they're only allied convoys, yeah. Uh, fighters, yeah, this is ridiculous. Oh my god, I wish it was. A, I wish I could just highlight all of these. Is there. Is, am I stupid? No, I don't think you can. I'm holding on shift, and nothing happened. Uh, I'm gonna save. Anything that's over like 200, I'm gonna save from here on out. Oh, look at all these, and the game has to detail that you have one of each. Oh, makes makes a lag almost unbearable. Oh my god, how many naval bombers are there? Am I not making any more naval bombers? Uh, I'll keep everything above 500, but that seems like I took those. Uh, that should be much better. Ask we'll get rid of this one too. Okay. All right, and then transport planes. We don't need those. Strategic bombers. I'm surprised we took so many strategic bombers. Whatever, I know I'm getting rid of a lot of good ones, but at this rate, I don't want too much to clutter myself up. Alright, so let's actually continue focus on the game here. Oh, we're doing very well into France, but the UK is looking very disgusting. Oh! Okay, sure. Come back and we annex Flanders Valonia. Liberate to the commune of France? Why would I do that? And India. Now, India... Wait, what? I'm not sure I'm understanding. Why are they capitulating to m me? Why is India capitulating to me? Huh. Oh, well, whatever, I guess. Uh, I'm going to need a lot more score for this. So, um, I'm really not sure why they're capitulating to me, but I did say before 
that I wanted to kind of recreate the Mughal Empire, so it'll have a different name than, you know, Iran. It'll be named Iran, but, uh, I'm gonna give a lot of territory to Iran. I like how Hyderabad is, so we'll basically have the Mughal Empire, and then we'll have Hyderabad, maybe combined with Burma or something like that. Something like that, maybe. But I'm not sure why they capitulated to me. Or I don't I didn't even realize I guess I was at war with them. Oh well. Uh, what's going on up here? Like, they're attacking us. I guess my puppets. Central American Confederation? Yeah, no thanks. Uh, Arabia? Yeah, I'm not feeling it, Arabia. I'm sorry. Uh, 43,000, 15 divisions. Scraping the barrel for 43,000 extra soldiers? Yeah, that's what I thought. Uh, ooh, that's not good. These guys will probably die out here. That's unfortunate. Um, go ahead and do that. Just go ahead and retreat from Sevilla. Ace five promoted. Very good. Very, very good. Our planes are working currently. Good. And that is giving us a little bit of air coverage. What's going on over here? Oh, our convoys are getting attacked. That's really not good, yeah. But they're not my convoys, they're Danish, and they wanted to fight for us. So that's good. That's good for us. Oh, how about you guys? Are you guys doing well? Are you guys... Oh, some of you are injured. Some of you guys are injured. They'll be done by 50. 1950, June 1st or so. But yeah, we definitely need to put more airplanes in here. Come on, guys. Hurry up with those air bases. I need more. Uh, it's... This is still so bad. Yeah, I'm just going to get rid of everything that I'm not producing. So, we'll do that in a, a little bit later, because I don't want to just... How am I getting all these... Uh, capitulated India, as well as Flanders Valonia. That's, what, uh, that's what's going on. Oh my god, how many rocket interceptors? Where are my heavy fighters? Heavy fighters. Right, we have 800 planes, and we need more people doing their jobs here. You can down a lot of planes. That's alright. Uh, let's see, better answers that we're pretty much done with already. Now just keep pushing into France as best you can, guys. How many times has France or Paris capitulated? They capitulated against a commune of France, I believe. Uh, I can't remember when else they capitulated. Ooh, we are doing nothing over here. And these are actual Austrian divisions that I've just kind of left over here to guard Vienna, but whatever. Can you guys just take Zurich? That might just capitulate these guys. Ooh, yeah, send the tanks in. That might just distract them enough for us to take it. Oh, that's a lot of divisions. Holy cow. Um, I don't want to nuke my own soldiers, so I'm not. But I'll nuke these guys. I haven't used nukes in Europe yet. And I don't want to nuke the city. Just the area outside the city. Ah, very nice. Very warm. We're making Switzerland warm again. Oh, I think we have Baron. Yeah, Baron is ours. Very nice. Very nice job. Uh, let's see, how am I going to divide all this up? I mean, we obviously have Belgium. I know what to do. I know what exactly to do. Now, I'm going to do this. Liberate Flanders and Valonia. I'm going to occupy them. Now, that's going to hurt us a little bit, but I'm going to kind of change this up. Force support stability. It's going to be five. That's good enough. Uh, uh, no, because I don't want to get those convoys destroyed. But what I am currently thinking... Ooh, we are barely holding on here. Interesting. But what I am thinking currently is that I'm going to liberate the whole of the Benelux. The entire Benelux will be liberated. I'm going to liberate the Benelux under one into one nation. Back. And that'll be a direct puppet of Austria, now known as the German Empire. At this point, are we... It's like I'm, I've reformed the Holy Roman Empire without the Netherlands. Because we have the Italian Republic as an ally. We're taking a good chunk of like what what was Burgundy. We have Belgium now, we have Luxembourg, we have all of the whole of Germany, including old Prussia, which was never part of the Holy Roman Empire. Uh, this is just a, a Holy Roman Empire, you know, version two. Ooh. Too bad he can't change names. That'd be kinda cool. 
We were the Austrian Empire, oh, that's scary, and a battleship. We were the United States of Greater Austria. At one point in history, we were known as Austria-Hungary, but now we're known as the German Empire, and maybe someday we'll be known as the version 2 of the Holy Roman Empire. That'd be very interesting. I like to change names, and this is actually the one, the first campaign I've played through that we've kind of already had three different monarch or leaders at least, three different leaders. So we started off with the great monarch Franz Joseph, and then we had his nephew, I think it was his nephew or grandnephew, Karl, Karl Kaiser, one of the best daddies you could have ever asked for, and then we now have Otto the first. Now I don't know if there's anyone after Otto, I hope Otto doesn't pass away. But, uh, that'd be cool if we had a fourth one, just saying. Yeah. Alright, so how many Swiss men have to die for their sins? I should speed it up a little bit. Mm. Gotta always have a little bit of water to, water to wash out that coffee taste in your mouth. Uh, let's see, the Entente, Canada, UK... United States, yeah. I'm going to have to capitulate all those. Now, since we have so many puppets and so many divisions that are puppets, oh, and Zerk has capitulated. Awesome. I'm, I have a good feeling that Russia, since they invaded the UK the first time, they're pretty good at invading, so they'll probably invade them again. Now, I could use my tanks to help capitulate the former allies of the Reichsback. Or, you know, I could do that. But we have a menace up north. Oh, I need more six. I need more political power. That's not good. Ah, Switzerland. At this point, liberate to liberate to the German Empire. What are they talking about? I am the German Empire. Uh, I'm just gonna take those states, my boy. I don't know about you, but we're getting the band back together. And by the band, I'm talking about the Holy Roman Empire back together. Uh, oh, shites. They have it as a oh wait the the actual other German Empire has it as a core so that means I should have this as a core as well. I love that logic. Yeah, I, I might as well just core it because the German Empire had it as a core, so I should core it right. That makes perfect sense. And I'm bum bum. God dang it. Yeah, I want to make sure I'm doing the right ones. I don't want to double bump myself. All right. Oh my God, we lost 103 convoys. Holy crap! That's why I didn't want to do any trade deal with you guys. Uh, that's probably a bunch of Serbs or D Danish on those ships. But that's okay. Uh, yeah, you guys can go here. You guys help out. That should be better. Oh my God, negative 52 political power. Uh, that's not good. And the UK, even though they capitulated and they came back, they're still getting taken out by like three divisions from Italy and German China. Good job, guys. Good job. Where are you guys at? You do not have a job. Kind of like me. And... Oh, we own all this. Sounds good. Where are you guys? Yeah, just go right ahead. I mean, there's no point waiting. Uh, I have five divisions to help take out... Oh, that area. I think. Actually, you know what? We're going to switch to you guys. Down to help guard the Suez and now what you already are doing. you should be doing, but I need these five divisions actually, because I'm sending them to Europe, because there's a little uh, hole in the line right here, Den Haag, very good, alright, ooh, enemy destroyer sunk, oh my gosh, this is this is like our last stand here in Spain, these are my territories, stop, better not take them, better not take them guys, won't be real upset with you, god, it's taking forever to produce more things, more, uh, Airbase, or at least enlarge the airbase size. Any fighters, any fighters, there we go. Alright, very good. Oh. You guys don't have jobs? You guys don't have phones? Oh, I have four divisions up here already. Whatever, I'll just double stack it then. Alright, very good. Modern tank destroyer. Yeah, we'll get a 1936 heavy tank thingamabob. Yeah, some of our guys are just walking in. We have a lot of factories, holy cow. Can I trade you factories for political power? That'd be great. Italy will be a tough nut to crack, though. Even though our Italian allies are trying to break into Italy, 
Italians have a lot of divisions. The enemy Italians. It's almost like an Italian civil war at this point. No, thank you. Alright. Looks like we need more planes up here, too. Alright, let's see. Oh, the German government's up here as well. It's not good. We are not making enough factories. Or, I mean, enough planes. What's going on? What's our production like? Advanced anti-air. Strategic bombers. Heavy fighters. We're making tw almost 22 a day. And yet we can't produce enough. What's going on, man? Look how many factories we have. Holy crap. I, I definitely don't need that many. I'll put you the... Oh, look at the, how many resources we have. Holy cow. I need to re really readjust everything here. I'll uh, put you in the bottom. And then put you at the bottom as well. Because I'm going to greatly expand this. Got this trade stuff. Uh, yeah, I don't need to borrow as much from you. Oh, yeah, don't borrow anything from them because our convoys are getting sunk. We have a ton of steel. Oh, I see. I totally forgot about all this. Denmark, you're doing great. I don't need those, though. Yeah, we got a lot of steel, at least at the moment. And then chromium from Russia. No, thank you. Oh, right. We will need more aluminum, though. Uh, divisions. Uh, Poland, I don't want to kill those Polish boys off, but the Ottomans, you are our, you were our historical enemies, so we'll take your boys and throw them onto some divisions over here. They might die, they may not. I'm giving you no guarantees. <laughs> Alright, uh, let's go ahead and go to Baki. You guys finish these guys off, and then you guys take these guys off. I forgot we were at war with Azerbaijan, to be honest. Slowly taking out France. Very good. Slowly, slowly, slowly. Uh, we got divisions up here almost ready to go. Using our tanks, we should be fine enough. They only have level 1 forts. Some these tanks are pretty darn good, which actually reminds me. Heavy armor, I don't think we need that. Armor divisions, let's go ahead and replace some of these with, oh my gosh, super heavy tanks, that'd be awesome. But no, modern tanks. I'm a generic type of guy, I'm like, alright, modern tank sounds good enough. Are we in a deficit? Yes, we are. Oh, I might have hit them a little too hard. Oh, Ooh, you guys. Look hard, nothing. He's level 7 general. That's really good. Level 7 general? Yes, please. Oh, we're still good. We're still good down there. How's Brazil? You know, having our navy down here didn't really do very much for us. I mean, I guess we're, we are attacking a few convoys. But, uh, you know what? we do this. Oh, excuse me. Thank you. Ah. God dang it. Oh, there we go. Let's see if we can encounter anything in the middle of the Atlantic Ocean. I'm surprised Brazil has not capitulated yet, either. So with this in mind, I'm going to take Azerbaijan for myself, but give it to... Of course. The Persians. Mark transfer. And now the Persians will call it. So they don't release anybody. Good. And even if they do, the game the only thing that happens is the game will lag and Yeah, I mean we'll just have to redo that. Alright, so these guys are done. You guys did a great job. I'm not done with you though. I am sending you to Africa next. Oh god. Look at this line. Let's see where you, guys are. you guys are up north. You guys are down here in the south. Alright, cool. So both of you are gonna come over here. And you will all Get ready to go to war with the German government in exile. Does anyone have a general? Do we have any spare generals? No. They're all being used, which is appropriate. Alright, I believe that our tanks are good to go. I don't really foresee any problems. Uh, actually, I do see a problem. The Batavian commune isn't under our control. And... You must love the lag. You just get used to it. Oh, happy 1950! Anyways, guys, I didn't catch it. It was 1950 about four days ago. Fourteen days ago or so. so. Oh, right. Yeah, the Batavian coming. I'm surprised they didn't join the Third International or anything like that. But, you know, they do themselves and I'm not doing them. That's that's weird to say, but they're gonna die. Uh, let's see. No, no. Ooh, the Moroccans are back. Hello, Morocco! 
Long time no see. Just be careful when you attack, guys. Just be careful. Oh, you definitely need better stuff like there. Hmm. We could use maybe better radar, but we're already working on that. Down here, we might be able to use better radar. I, I'm sure we're already making enough, though. Uh. Yeah, something tells me we're making enough radar anyways. Uh, ships are in the waters looking for something to kill. Good. Just go ahead and take out Brazil, please. They should be. They should have died like six episodes ago, which even though I only declared war on the Rex back like what, two episodes ago. Uh, let's see. God, Brazil's a freaking mess. I hate. This is so disgusting. It's so disgusting. Just go ahead and just take them out if you can. Do that. Something like that. And then you guys. It's like come up here or something. Uh, you, you might as well do the same. Cool. Awesome. Sweet. This is disgusting. Even though the German Chinese are fighting basically for themselves at this point, they've still taken a, quite a bit of territory. They're not giving up the fight yet. I mean, they're, they're taking out Texas, for God's sakes. They took, out, took back Chicago. They're like halfway through to, through Michigan, through Wisconsin. Oof, don't mess with the German Chinese. Don't mess with China. Because I guess China, they got, they got a lot of bodies. You know what happens when they, people got a lot of bodies? They they don't care about each individual. They just throw as many men to the problem as they can, and usually it'll give them some pretty good results. Alright. Clear those guys out. Amsterdam will be ours, and we will liberate a good, good puppet in the Benelux. Which will no longer be referred to as a Benelux, hopefully, if I remember correctly. But it will be referred to as... Something else. I don't know. I don't know. I'm not sure what to call them. Convoy lost. A couple convoys lost. German China. They we haven't really advanced too far, but they're 48% of the way towards capitulation, as well as the French Kingdom. Good, good, good. The Brazilians are like 75%, 74% of the way towards capitulation. That's awesome. Uh, guys, there's no one there. You might as well just go on in. Ooh, there's there is a group down here though that we need to take out. And then I'm gonna take the tanks. You go to Ah Ahmadabad, whatever it is. Good. Oh, we did sing something, though. We sunk six Chinese convoys in the mid-Atlantic. Okay. Sure, we'll roll with that. How are you guys doing? You guys are doing... You guys are doing okay. It's good. Good to know, guys. Oh, and the French Kingdom has finally capitulated. Those bunch of chunky bastards. Uh, liberation? I'm not thinking about liberation right now. I'm not thinking about that at all. Now... I'm going to send everyone to Spain. Uh, it doesn't really matter how they're looking right now, just because we will just basically go straight up and attack. I will take all of you, though, and come to Brest, because we do need to capitulate Brittany. You guys come here. Take those guys out. And then go to Lorient. And carrier fighters. Very good. Oh, and this, these guys are almost done. Very awesome. Very cool. Ah, these divisions dying. Oh, the UK is capitulated. Okay, but sort of the Batavian Commune. Awesome. Very cool. So that means our tanks are done. They can actually help reinforce Brest or take out Brest. Oh, when they get down there. Actually leaves a lot of room for us to maneuver within Europe. Hmm, interesting. Very interesting. Our soldiers are still trying to get down to there. We're carving this area up very nicely. You just get over here, and you might as well just come up here. Alright, we're doing very well, guys. Very, very well. We are still suffering a lot of convoy loss up here, though. What the hell is going on? Just... Oh, Qingdao's out down here. Oh, and this is... What the hell is owning this? Huh. Interesting. Ooh, wait. Oh, I have another... You know what? We don't. I found out we didn't even need these guys, so we're done making those guys. Uh, shoots divisions. We have. We have enough. I'll keep making tanks, but other than that, I mean, we don't really need that much more. How long do we have? We got. Oh, we got plenty of time before we do anything else. Oh, look at the UK. Oh, that's disgusting. Someone, if you're Irish, please comment below. Is this what you want to see Ireland as? That's disgusting, but also kind of cool at the same time. Oh, they're they're occupied by the Irish and the Italians. Is, is that, like, 
Uh, but go on. Uh, I'm not really sure. I know there's a lot of poles in the UK at this point, especially in London, but... It's kind of odd. Just go ahead, finish them off. Finish those bastards off. And we're coming down to Spain to help liberate our Turkish armies down here. Oh! Oh, look at that. Look how nice this should be. But Brittany is done. Very good. Awesome. You know what? I'm going to end the episode here. You guys were at the 30-minute mark, and we've done a very bang-up job, and this will give us time to collaborate, guys. So, what have we done? We've capitulated, I would say, most of the uh, Western Front at this point. We are going into Spain, finding success. We will need to turn our attention to two Sicilies next time. The UK has once again capitulated. We are trying to strike into Northern Africa once more. We are desperately trying to get rid of these bastards named Brazilians. And we're doing, honestly, pretty darn well if we catch my breath. And next time we should also be able to push further into German China since we have opened up basically a whole other front. But with that in mind, guys, thank you very much for watching. Before you leave, though, please comment on how you would like to see me divide up France. Should it be one whole country? Should it be two puppet states uh, under me, Occitania or Occitan? and the northern French portion under me, or should just annex it because the German Empire is the best empire in the history of the freaking world. Thank you very much for watching, though. Leave a like if you liked the video, subscribe if you're new here, and I will see you tomorrow. Thank you very much, and do mean it, for watching.